Oh, is your mic turned up? Yeah. It's bigger. Sh- no, it's not. I'm just saying. Oh. Oh, okay. Because. Nah, because we uh, isn't this the part we want to record before the show starts? Remember? Yeah, that's what we're doing right now, I guess. Yeah. So. Hey. Anyway. We Bitch, are I'm speaking. Talking. Yeah. Uh, no, I already did sound check. <sighs> All right. No, it's already recording. No, you good. You good. No, let it ride. No, you're still going to drop the intro in, just like usual. And then after that, then we'll go back into when the show starts. So, so. I'll stop it, do the thing, then go back. No, you should be able to just drop it and try it, because he wants to do a record as before we start. You see? Okay. Yeah, yeah you can yeah. just drop it in, and then, yeah, it'll be good. Because now we're doing before the show. Yeah, it's mm-hmm. That's a good color. It is. It is. You got your ass seat all warm. It's ridiculous. <laughs> she feel like a loser for her third failed marriage. Who oh. heard? She was married three times? Yeah. Who? Has a third? She was married to that white nigga. Nah, who? Who? Humphreys, you ain't talking Kanye. to the mic. Y'all not talking oh. into the mic. Chris Humphreys, oh, Kanye. Yeah, you say. You oh, um, she wasn't married to uh, Reggie Bush. I think she was engaged to Reggie Bush, wasn't she? I don't know. I didn't know. Hold up. Let's check that. Let's check that. Let's yeah, check. I, was I, that I, Kim I, K? Yeah. She yeah. said she felt like a loser for her third failed marriage. But she still looked good doing it. So does Amen. it really matter? What does three failed marriages really mean in America? When you a billionaire. When you a billionaire, there's no such thing as an ugly billionaire. Jay Z once told me that. <laughs> Not a nigga still ugly. (laughs) (laughs) Bro, you know, episode, I think it's like, I'm thinking it's the shop or LeBron show. The shop, that's my shit. Where he had to go out after DMX. What? Oh, shit. Bro, the best, the greatest story. I don't even want to butcher it. I want y'all to like just watch it. Yeah. Who are you? Imagine trying to, imagine trying to go up after DMX. That's there's some rappers like, oh, Jay Z. Yeah. yeah, Like if I was a rapper, I wouldn't go behind. Like if, if they was on the set before me. You can have it. I'm going to just Time say out. it. Who? She was married to a dude named Damon Thomas. That's her first ex-husband. And How long was they married for? When 2000 was to 2004. Damn. And I, yeah. that was before, oh, wow. That was before who she was. They were together for four years, but when he was... Drop? Hold up. He was the <laughs> um, producer for... At the beginning of Kim Kardashian. Right he was there. the producer mm-hmm. for Mary J. Blige and Chris Brown. He was a producer for them? Yeah. When it, nigga in 2000 and 2004 he That's was no more drama he was their producer uh-huh damn and then hey, she when was did with the reggie Re- when did the uh ray j when did the <laughs> 2004 sex 2006 damn she was with nick lachey that's crazy nigga when did the sex tape i just told you 2000 well, so she was married to that nigga before the sex tape That's 2004 2006 that's why nobody knows. That's why nobody knows. Yeah. Because, like, the beginning of her life. Nick Cannon. She, oh, yeah. I know she was fucking with Nick Cannon. Right. Ma- for a year. Hey, Nick yeah. Cannon used to get a lot of bitches. Bro, bro. 2007. Bro, I hate that up there. Used to, stupid. <laughs> I mean, like, he got seven kids, I guess. 2007, right? 2010. <laughs> she was with Reggie Bush, and then she was with some other football nigga, Miles Austin. Mm. He used to play for the Cowboys. Some nigga named Gabriel Aubrey. Who are these niggas? And then Chris Humphreys. There we go. That's my error. Well, he he and only married her for like some fame of, or some shit. Like for th- nigga, you in the NBA and you marrying for fame, you down bad, bro. Yeah, super down. bad. That nigga was down bad. Uh, <laughs> nigga, you're down super bad. Nigga, that your nigga job literally has bad. your last name plastered on your jersey, on your yeah. uniform. That nigga was down That's bad. True. And he got playing time. Right? That nigga was damn near seven feet. <laughs> damn. Mm-hmm. Kalani posted something. It should be a good episode. I've been saving my highs and lows. My I high for this week, y'all gonna be like, nigga, don't, what? Don't even say it. We, you know what? Matter of fact, let's let's get it started. Run let's get clip. started. Run a clip. Let's start oh yeah, the show. Vanessa Bryant right. not fucking with uh, Nike re-release releasing a shoe that she designed for yeah. her daughter. They re- redesigned it and selling it to other nah, people. Nah, they yeah, they selling it and they, she didn't agree to it. And there's an NBA player that wore it today huh. or the other day, so it's a wrap for Nike. Damn, Nike don't care. They don't. F- can you run the intro for us, my good brother? Hurry up, nigger. No, I see. No, I'm just fucking with you, man. See, I, know. <laughs> I love you. Every, <laughs> every, you every week I pray he comes. Yeah, he's not, he's not right. coming he next finally week. just started coming back. <laughs> and then you going to tell this nigga. Now we can talk some shit. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Doing Dope Shit. How you I am you? your host, 
Hot Boy Hames. I'm your co-host here, Augusto Cone. And I'm Big Wolf. How you know somebody watching? <laughs> How you know? I know somebody watching. Somebody right. watching. We try to figure out where they watch. At the very least, I'm talking to myself. Yeah. Because I watch. <laughs> we're, we're, we're documenting our friendship. Honestly. <laughs> That's Why? really it. We yeah, document really that it. shit every day. No, we don't. I don't even see y'all every day. Shut up, nigga. Why you lying? I haven't seen you in like I'm a just week. Around. Yeah, I know you haven't seen me in a long time. I don't see this nigga. I see you. <laughs> For <laughs> yeah. some reason. Yeah. A lot. <laughs> in FaceTime or something. But I FaceTimed this nigga like three times this week. Didn't pick I up pick not up. once. What you want? I was working on the site or doing some other shit. Some yeah, bullshit. Sure. Can't even mm-hmm. talk to the homie. Nope. Damn. Crazy. crazy. Or getting How we guts. broke already getting torn apart with Man. brokenness. <laughs> 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 we getting torn apart by brokenness. How, how's it already <laughs> starting? Ain't no money to fuck us up, bro. Yeah. <laughs> what is it? It ain't no bitches either because we all got our own. Right. What is it? You can't say that. I say my woman. Yeah. I refer to ah, my okay. woman. Okay. I say my so bitch. Like, I, refer right. to, I refer to bitches when I'm referring to my exes. Shouts <laughs> out to Key because you got him on the straight and narrow. I now. saw, a dope, t- I saw <laughs> a dope meme. That shit said... Uh, <laughs> All that misogyny shit, oh, that shit don't have nothing to do with my girl. I'm right. talking to y'all bitches. Yeah, right, right, <laughs> right. Honestly, <laughs> see, nah, but right, not. right. But yeah. all of our, we all have our own women, so what's tearing mm. us apart, man? Mm. I don't think we don't even got contracts yet, bro. Come no, on, I'm saying. Oh, not yet. Oh, we. I think that's contracts. what I'm waiting on. Yeah, he needs his contract. Oh, uh, yeah. we can, I can, I, oh we okay, hurry, bet. He needs to hurry up and sign this nigga now before he needs to. You know, <laughs> no, bet. We gonna we gonna drop this. Joe Button looking for niggas, bro. Joe Button. Hey, bro, you know Bro, the way you Joe, think, way Joe Budden keeps fucking up, I think there's going to be a space for us very soon. Is he fucking up though? Yeah, yeah. You yeah. think no, so? He's good at starting things and and like and fucking up. <laughs> like, bro, he think about it. He started <laughs> fucking the bounce our, back, bro. But here's the thing: he started fucking our favorite hip hop show by date. I thought you was about to say hip hop group Slaughterhouse. <laughs> 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 I'd be like, nah. All right, Who's favorite group. No, 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 <laughs> that no, nigga no. don't even like that shit. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I'm just saying our favorite show. Men, they, I, that, I, they look, I say this. I, I, you're right. Mm-hmm. He fucks up a lot of shit, bro. Mm-hmm. But I think his bounce back is crazy. Because he it did is. bounce back from everyday struggle. Well, right. it's only crazy because he has to create something new. And people are like, oh, let's see if he fuck it up. Yeah, but you think Roy and Mal going to be able to do? Oh, like, hell yeah. stand on their own? I Nigga, think, after I that one clip of, I saw? I think a lot of hype in the beginning. I think, I think the first a lot of couple hype. episodes, they're going to ride the coattails of whatever happened. Yeah. And then that's when they're really going to have to show out, like, all but right. What like, if it's good? I mean, it probably could be. It could be. be but I, I'm not, I'm just not holding my breath yet. Based yeah, off of either. that one clip? Yeah. I'm, but I don't yeah, but it. in that one clip, nigga, they referenced Joe Budden, like, Yeah, I know, but yeah. They, they did it really well. Yeah, but that's still, still, you can't do that. <laughs> like, Joe Budden has a, only, like, only reference he, I, I'll be honest with you guys, I'm going to come clean. And it was late. It was the Amiri cap <laughs> I'm going to come clean. I'm still watching the well, Joe Budden podcast. The detergent shit. Yeah. I'm still watching the Joe Budden podcast with those weird niggas. I'm when not. they talk, I just, for some reason, I just, <laughs> I just mute. I just, <laughs> I just mute. I don't you know. there to see what Joe Budden says. But what, what Joe Budden says. So, I don't know. Like I'll wait for the clips. I, yeah. I don't know. I'm, 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 I agree with you. I'm not holding my breath. Yeah. But I know for the first couple episodes, it's going to do really well. For sure. For sure. I ah! You don't think? You don't think so? You don't think so? <laughs> no, I think it's going to do well. But <laughs> I just wanted to make that noise. Oh, I, well, Shut nigga, up. what? <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> nigga said, ah! Like, <laughs> nah, y'all, all right. Um, Bug it. And nigga, hit the highs Anyways, what's going on? Yeah. Highs and lows. Highs and lows. <laughs> just get right Who want to go it. first? Ty, go first. Let me go first. Oh, uh, highs for this you. week? Um, ah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> that's my hot. He's saying 10 more times yeah. is the name of the episode. Yeah, ah, yeah. ah! That's three, yeah. nigga. Ah. Um, uh, ordered the new shorts, ordered new hats, Bang. and we got stickers. Boom. What kind of shorts you got? You're going to have to wait and What's see. What's the material? You're going to have to wait and see. We all right, have that. I'm going to ask you again after the show and the camera off. All right. Yeah, right. That's, all a different, right. that's a different discussion. Yeah. yeah. That's good. Yeah. No lows? Fuck a low. Fuck a low. Hey. I like that hey, energy. Man, I like that. I like, I like that, that energy. Um, I'll go next. Today was a fucking good ass day. Hey! Hey! Hey, today was probably like one of the greatest days I've ever had in a long time. Yo, Talk right? about it. Fucking magazines coming real soon. Bitch. Shirts. Ooh. I got shirts. I got merch coming Bitch. real soon. Don't, no, no. I got no, some no, money no. coming real don't, soon. Don't, Bitch. Don't. Um, don't, yeah, don't, man. Don't, had a good day. Don't. That's Dude, good. Pretty much I it. I was doing the instrumental. To, today was a good day. <laughs> right. Know? Yeah. Uh, my low for the week. My low. I got to go work tomorrow. 
That's not really low. But I'd be lying to you if I said I wasn't thinking about not going stop, back. Stop. Come on, bro. See, this is why you can't give him a bulk and, and, amount of uh, money uh, in exactly. one go. Because right. then thinking he'd thinking be like, man, money. I'm good. Yeah, right. Till he spend that shit. I got to work. Fuck uh, y'all. <laughs> no. Uh, no, I'm going to go back. All right. I'm going to go back. I'm going to go back. You ain't got a choice. I'm going to tell Danielle. No, I'm going to go back. She ain't going to see it. She's not going to watch this shit. I might go to the beach on Sunday. Hey, what's it? What Daniel's family's house? going to the beach. Newport. Newport. Oh, you do they rich take nigga. food to the beach? I don't know. They got an Airbnb oh. on the beach Whoa. at Newport. Whoa! Bro, your, your family get. Hey, money. bro, let me fuck with y'all. That you know, hold on. Do you we know can. what Newport Beach is? That's no. what I'm saying. Oh, yeah. Wait, but you're. You, you remember we pulled up to the crib. We saw the yeah. Maserati in the X6 in we front. We saw the Range Rover that you had the order. And the Range Rover. That you have to specially order. I keep order. asking Danielle, what's wow. your dad do for a living? He said. Her answer, truck driver. Truck driver. I said, let me ask him to get in on the truck driver. <laughs> he the only <laughs> truck driver that don't be on the road. Because <laughs> that nigga be chilling, bro. Man. I don't know, I'm man. I'm trying to drive trucks. I'm trying to drive trucks. Honestly, man. it's pretty lucrative. Niggas make like seven dollars Truck driving actually is really lucrative, bro. Yeah. But the downside of the nigga, they spend their entire life in the fucking cabin of a truck. Shouts out yeah. to IDKJ, who started his rap career by being a truck driver. Oh, that's did, tight. Did his first tours. On, he said he couldn't make money as a rapper. So he'll drop you off said loads. IDK, that's IDK, right? Yeah, he IDK J. But he took off the J. Yeah. He took off I'm the J. But he will literally be a truck driver, drive to a city, do a show there. Damn. Right. I'll so he'll get paid. He already got paid off the so show. So he, he he based his tour off his work schedule. Right. That's you know fucking if he's still hard. Driving? <laughs> that's fucking hard. No, no. He's I'm about to say shout out to the rappers who got nine to fives. Man. Shout out to my boy BFP the Pac Man. Yeah. Man. Hold Where my down. package at? It's yeah. late, nigga. No, no I, I ain't saying that. <laughs> you by yourself on that. <laughs> I respect you for your hard work, you man. Those the, the boys. Those the only boys in blue we respect. Yeah. Because pale blue. Yeah. Right. I don't know what the mother niggas doing. Maybe big time. They don't even be in blue, bro. They be in black. Maybe. Yeah. yeah. Black and blue. Ooh, you never hear about people having like beef with firefighters. Never. Because firefighters only can do good. They, they don't. How see, can you, how listen. can you racially promote a fire, nigga? <laughs> 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 this is a blue flame fire. Oh, I don't, I don't know. Oh. That, that fire look a little ethnic to me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I could fuck with that. A racist firefighter is a sick thought. <laughs> That's fuck. Because your whole job is just as. Bro, just it's to, to stop fires. fires. Right. Like, you not you don't give a fuck about what's going on, who in the fire. Nah, it's just to it stop is. the they, fire. They like pull up to a fire. Yeah. Also, oh, black people live in there. Nah. And they turn off, keep they going. Turn off the, they turn off the siren and just keep cruising. Just keep going. <laughs> oh, we'll be back. <laughs> But shit, nah, go ahead. Um, nah, nah, yeah, but nah. firefighters don't ever start shit, bro. <laughs> cops yeah, yeah, do. No, cops always. They only cops only come to make Imagine shit. Imagine the day where like a nigga, like a firefighter is in the news for being racist <laughs> and starting a fire in the a fire- black neighborhood. <laughs> what if all the firefighters became cops and all the cops became firefighters? Oh, we're fucked. We're fucked. <laughs> we're fucked. We're fucked. <laughs> we're fucked. <laughs> I'm gonna f- say calling the cops now when I get hurt, but if I got a fire, uh, I am not. Let the house burn. <laughs> let let it burn. You'd be out there us, uh, ushering out. Right? And then the <laughs> firefighter drive by. Firefighter drive by. Why don't you call us, nigga? You know. You know why. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but, you uh, right, right. But shit, no, the, the highs and lows, bro. Yeah, I just I did some bullshit. This is my high. I went to I went to my girl's dad and I told this nigga. Well, I'm gonna say this nigga because that's You're disrespectful. Good. Don't they yeah. don't they watch the show? <laughs> they watch clips, so you know it's not going to get clips. Every, everybody just watches <laughs> the, the clips. clips, you know? But I told Fuck y'all. I, I told my <laughs> girls, I told my yeah, shout out to our subscribers on YouTube. Shout, shout out to YouTube Fabian. Video. Shout out Shout out to Fabian shout and D Tree sometimes. Fabian and D Tree sometimes holding it down. You know what I'm saying? Shout and Ifani. Right? Yeah, for real. But um And Elijah. And a, <laughs> Um, I'll be the first one to watch the episode. And Danielle and Wes just because right. they got to sit in the room while it. they watch. And I watch it on the computer, so we don't even get the I, views let's for that. Get through it. But yeah, anyways, no, I told I told my girl's dad, I was like, look, I'm keep it funky with you. I'm marrying your daughter in Ooh. a year. So what do we Ooh. have to do? What do we have to do to arrange this to make sure that this goes smoothly in 12 months? Is that you asking her for him? For I, her hand I, I told him it wasn't a question. <laughs> Wait, I want to know how you got there. She tickled your butt while y'all was fucking. And, and no, no, I was, I was just, I, I literally thought of no, Wait, what? No, no. I, what happens? One of my exes texted me. Oh, some, that's what it was. No, one of my exes from high school texted me, and it was just, it was just like said, complete. Oh, these tripping. I gotta no, lock her down. No, <laughs> nigga, it was complete blasphemy. I said, whoa, this was my past. This is what I was on. 
I said, bro, not only did I, I, it was so bad. This was a girl that I blocked. Mm. She created a new account to tell me how she really felt again through a new account. Well, how and how I she said, really feel? I don't even remember the message. It's some bullshit. She, it's just some oh God, ratchet. Old bitch I God. still love you. It's because of that bro. last episode, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I still so, love you. So I was just like, man, fuck this shit. So I was like, I was really sitting here thinking, I was like, yeah, I, I got a solid one. I'm just going to see how this, how this works. So I didn't like. I told him, I was like, yo, this is my plan. This is what my finances look like. This is what my credit is at. And I just need to make sure in the next 12 months, every month, I'm going to meet with you to make sure that this happens. And so, that nigga said, nigga, I don't give a fuck about all that. Do you bro, beat her? Bro, no, nigga you I good? know who got a marketing plan <laughs> for marriage. <laughs> for marriage, bro. Like, you the only to. nigga that has set up a meeting to talk about marriage, bro. <laughs> talk about I got married. to. I got to. I got to. But uh, we, like I said, also, fuck the lows. We ain't had no lows over here. Yeah, except for my lows. fucking over. Bro. How Wells Fargo hit me with an overdraft fee, right? And yeah. then they hit me with another one right after. Like, there was yeah, already no money. charge that, you for that not nigga having said, money. Oh, you ain't got no money? Yeah. <laughs> Get him again. And, but, and then the cold part about it is that oh, the, charge you. the <laughs> other money that's was in the, sa- in the same account. So all they had to do is just att- it's nah, attached. That makes too much sense. Bro. Exactly. I was that just makes- shake my fucking head. I was just going to say that. I said, the what? The nigga's like, like, nah, there's a lot of logic here. I said, what? You Let's see not- the money. <laughs> Let's go the other why way. Are you, why yeah. are you fucking giving me the overdraft? I because said, man, I can't. I- Nigga. What it was, bro? Because they the can't. Look- <laughs> that's it. That's it. What it was, it. though, when the dude was looking at the computer, bro, he had a coffee stain smudged over the other <laughs> the other money in your account. <laughs> Somebody was like, you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. He, he said, wait. He broke. Oh. How many O's is that? Uh, I don't even think it's an O, nigga. Fuck it. <laughs> Anyways, uh, Ephraim, Ephraim, how you feeling over there, bro? Yeah, we yeah, what's your highs and lows for the yeah, week? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? We got to make sure that people know the man behind the board. And make sure... Every, oh, oh yeah! You, oh, we gotta turn off the fan. I was like, man, what, like, excuse, what, is, he, what is he doing? Excuse me, y'all. I'm supposed to be behind the camera. <laughs> oh, my, my fault. Another high. I got a new phone. Oh yeah, finally. Shit. Still don't want to put a case on that shit. Shut up, bitch. Hey, no I, game. I come over there and kiss you in the mouth. Say something again. Shut your weird ass up. Yeah. Got my clip. Continue. <laughs> Continue. <laughs> got my clip. Thank you. Uh, I no would say. <laughs> I finally graduated. And yeah. I did. You thought you wasn't going to get love for that yeah, nigga? Yeah, My nigga. boy, college educated. Ah, yeah. Degree me. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Don't you get like a $10,000 bonus for getting a college degree? Uh, who I'll told you that? Hey, <laughs> bro, he's black. The college first recruiter off. told me that in my high school. <laughs> first <laughs> off, he's what? black. Yeah. And a charger, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Let's, well, shut the. Uh, no, no time out. Wait, wait, wait. I got that joke. Shut what up. What if you did get up. a no. charger for no, graduating? No, no. Stop. Let Ephraim finish, please. Ephraim got a Hellcat this in is, front of the This is just like his graduation party. <laughs> <laughs> Him getting a Hellcat for a graduation. Oh, that, that, that's you outside? Ooh. Oh, yeah, and from when you graduate? <laughs> <laughs> But, uh, uh, and I would say I finished my website finally. Yes. Uh, there you go. That's good. Go ahead. That's give them the website yeah, name. Go. What's that link, bro? Yes. It's uh, at the website is perp.com. So P U R R R P.com. Yes, sir. P U Triple R P. Check my shit out. P U Triple R P. P U Triple R P. There it is. Yeah. I like threes. All right. There um, it is. Yeah. I ain't got no lows, though. That's good. That's, That's great. No lows, ain't nobody got lows this week. Now, you know what it is? I'm, yeah. I'm trying to get into a mindset where I don't let my lows, like, really control me. Mm. You know, you got to look past the lows and make your highs. There I feel that. I feel that. I feel that. So, speaking about no lows, speaking about highs, bro, we in the month of June, two weeks, it's official that this whole quarantine shit or whatever is supposed to be over, right? Even yeah. though it has been. Honestly, yeah. for like this whole year, yeah, and living in Kern County, I don't think it ever started. Nah, I don't think in Kern County, bro, I told y'all was open all the whole time. I didn't even know we were in a pandemic, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I thought masks was, was a, new a new fashion, fashion statement. statement right? Yeah, I really did, bro. I was like, oh, these tight. But yeah, so fucking the shit's supposed to be over this 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 uh, week or whatever. Next week, on my timeline, I've just seen a bunch of people getting ready to just act a straight fool. You're right, just act a fool, show straight ass. ass. Everybody's about to be showing their. Ass. Figuratively, yes. No, yeah, I'm not, not gonna be not looking. Literally. Literally. literally, I will not be looking. Nope, it's... not me neither. No, no, yeah. I ain't looking. I don't need to look at ass. I got the greatest ass. <laughs> no, I ain't got the greatest ass. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, it is I who has the greatest. <laughs> no, <laughs> nah, it'd be fucked up if I switched it up. and was like, no, <laughs> <laughs> oh, hell. Hell and then no. we, 
I'm really just gonna have to stop and look at you. Like, no, he got uh, the. the gra- <laughs> no, see, no, that. Hey, that, I didn't episode forget. over. I didn't forget. Episode episode I didn't forget over. either. <laughs> <laughs> I had to tread lightly. I didn't forget either. Oh gosh. Oh my. Good. I'm, about to, I'm about to walk out. Oh this way, my god, that's sick. But, that's sick. <laughs> but you're it's, right. It's moments like this why our podcast is so successful. Yeah, because I if guess. you can read between the lines, this shit's really funny. It is Honestly, funny. It's it's hilarious. Yeah. It's Watch hilarious. the episodes. Y'all yeah. really fucking up. You got, no, you got to start on the episodes before the video to get that. Joke. Honestly, it yeah. was like way back, way yeah. back. But um, um, yeah. you're right, man. Like the world's opening up. Everybody's getting back to normal. Right. <laughs> This summer is going to be summer 2016 times like 15, times, bro. What was controller? Was that controller year? Yeah. Although I think 2015 was the precursor to 2016. That's Fetty Wap. Yeah. 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 Right. No, nah, it's about to be summer 16, bro. Drake was on top, bro. These yeah. women out here, bro. Mm. They, about to, they about to go crazy. No, nigga. Nigga, these niggas. No, these, these niggas. It's everybody. Niggas and women. <laughs> I ain't going to it's, niggas I, out here talking wreck. Like niggas is talking like they all <laughs> got their first the rap on. deal. Like they got their advance, yeah, nigga. But the crazy thing is that this shit is working. Oh yeah, this yeah. shit is working. If yeah. you can't get some shit this summer, bro. Yeah, it's not. Listen, meant- if you're not getting no pum pum this <laughs> summer, you're a lame. Yeah, right. <laughs> That's it. You're a lame. Do not force yourself <laughs> upon these women. Yes. Yeah, don't do that. Don't do it. it but you're be, a lame, yeah. bro. The, but the nah. stock market, the, like the stock market for like just overall intercourse. This I shit looking say. like AMC, bro. Nigga, on the <laughs> ground. It, it, yeah. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> what, what you got to say, yeah. nigga? Could I just tell y'all, my shares was up $80. Good. Yeah, I bought in at $10. No, yeah. That was a, a, $80 a stock a joke. Share. Yeah. yeah, bro. You up. What? Wait, you I'm up? Just mad that's buy seventy dollars, bro. If you even I'm buy mad one, I didn't buy more. Wow. Yeah, well, that's how it's supposed to work, you know. You know, it's, it's I really like, gotta get in on the stock game. Wait, yeah. hold up, man, Ephraim, you're a single, you the only single motherfucker amongst us, right? Yeah, m- what are your, m- what are your m- expectations m- m- for, m- this, m- for this? You just graduated. Oh shit! And it's, it's summertime. Yeah, what you doing? Yo, first summertime in like two years. How many cheeks you bussing, bro? <laughs> what's it now? Nah, what's like? Let me know what the weather's man. looking like for How like just you just like nothing. debauchery. All right, fuck all that shit, nigga. We, we got a podcast. You got to tell the truth, nigga. <laughs> I don't even know what you're talking about. Oh, Bro, come on. Oh, he doing that. Nigga, oh, I oh, need oh, to know oh, what the thottery oh, is oh, looking like. This nigga lying. Okay. Let's be theoretical you're here. You're not even on camera, bro, so you can really say anything. Exactly. So Honestly, let's be right. theoretical. And I got to post this on my page. <laughs> so you, re- I'm, I'm on under fires right now. <laughs> Honestly, I'm, I'm right. trying real nah, hard. Nah, this is a real say question. Some, say some crazy shit. Nigga. Bro. What you trying, what you trying to say? Mm. Bro, bro I really... Right? <laughs> <laughs> I really... I really want to hear what you got going on because, bro... <laughs> I know what the <laughs> listen back in the day. I know what the first couple of weeks before June oh. or before July, before July Fourth, bro. If I you ain't lying. crack some nigga, I was lying. Oh my, yeah, I was lying. Sh- all, spring, look, spring was to, how you set the seeds for oh, what you, you have to, to realize. For the summer. Bro, I have been 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 in held like held inside that house, bro, for so long. Nigga, yeah. concerts is coming out, bro. Nigga, bro. bro. All nigga this shit, have you bro? seen Talk have you seen it, Rolling bro. Loud? I E. I'm going. Yeah. I'm going to Rolling Loud, bro. Yeah, they try to call it Rolling Loud Southern California. Yeah, yeah. Just because it's in San Bernardino. <laughs> <laughs> you go exit Waterman to go to Rolling Loud. It's, it's I, I, why would they do that in, I, I in don't, San Bernardino? Why would they? Nigga, why you got Rialto that? right next Remember, to you it. Got, Indio you got right Remi- there, bro. Oh, explain Indio to the people. right down okay. the street. Okay, so y'all think of your worst hood, right? Boom. And... Probably multiply it by like at least five or ten, unless you win Watts. All right. Then just go across the street because that's exactly what San Bernardino <laughs> is. All right. <laughs> because it's the most ratchet place in California. It's the worst place in the world, bro. nigga. And this is the location for the rolling out. So many people are gonna get robbed. Just Everybody's like getting robbed. listen, Everybody's getting just robbed. like people were wilding when they heard um, All Star Weekend was gonna be in yeah, Atlanta. Atlanta. This is worse because the world is opening up, and it's San Bernard fucking Dino, uh-huh. nigga. If there's one place in the world that never experienced what like the COVID uh, pandemic was, bro, it's San Bernardino. They didn't even know didn't even nothing know. about nothing, nigga. They was just doing San Bernardino. Nobody got a mask in that city. <laughs> doing San Bernardino <laughs> shit every fucking day. Nobody got a mask. They didn't run out of toilet paper because it's San Bernardino. Toilet paper, nigga. San Bernardino. 
Sam Bernardino. Where do you walk? Sam Bernardino, I know, is so sick because they've created their own Snoop Dogg. Oh. And because oh. they've created their own version of somebody oh, who's still nigga. living, I said, this city's yeah. got to be different. Yeah. This city's got they got Like, they know he's still alive. Like, <laughs> that's, I, like, that's like me calling said, myself don't, Chris don't Brown. Don't compare me to Snoop and right. then start rapping and looking like Snoop. With a lowrider and do it. I said, bro. Because he know he's trying to be Snoop. Right. But that's not the point. But yeah. The point is, it's going to be a wild summer, nigga. Right. Yeah. And Good job. Bringing it back. I just, I just want to know, like, back. Yeah. <laughs> what's going on? I just want to know what the scene is looking like right now because I know back in like twenty, like seventeen, bro, going into into that summer around like May, April, April, May. I was getting a tattoo on my lip, nigga. That's when you started wild. I wasn't doing anything. That was when you ended all of your um your fall and your winter flings, bro. No. 2017. I think you weren't even wearing drawers that spring. I'm not even trying to be funny. Now you know why? I'm not even trying to. Now be funny. you know no, why, this bro? This is a real moment. No, this that's, that's for real, bro. It's just easier to get into. Bro, I just take the pants off and now I'm fucking. I, bro, I, what's up? I, you y'all think I'm being funny? Like Tyrone what's up, was not bro? wearing like, drawers in, in that. In nah, that like I just take the pants off now I'm fucking. And even better, after I get you know the nut off my dick, throw it back in the pants and then I'm out. Whoa! Yo, <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Yo like so. Hey, we need a flag. We ever, ever, we gonna get you a flag, bro? That's like in football that you can just throw <laughs> on it. That you can just flag throw. on a fucking play. That was really questionable. They got the T. Was it? Yeah. <laughs> Dang! Yeah. How they ejected basketball? Yeah. Dang! Dang! That's how he really was the nigga to wear five hundred one jeans with no drawers. <laughs> <time. laughs> no nigga, draws? I wore skinnies <laughs> and then I put the five hundred one jeans <laughs> over the skinny. Yo, yo, boot yo. Cut wow, jeans. Boot? His drawers was basketball shorts. <laughs> like, his drawers was PE shorts, nigga. Like, that's... You sick. You a sick. That two sets of basketball shorts, nigga. You a sick. Nigga. One because I got the drawers. <laughs> the other one from when I hoop. That's yeah. sick. Yeah. Um, but yeah, nigga, it's crazy because, nigga, we, we won't be able to experience what this summer is going to... It's nah, supposed to bring. Thank God. Right? Yeah, I'm happy I'm out Honestly, I'm happy. Sick. I'm fucking happy. In another universe, this is where I catch my first STD. Yep. Yep. Luckily, I caught it in this universe, <laughs> so I don't have to worry about know. that, I, bro. I don't want to think about, <laughs> about what. <laughs> I don't want to think. So, see, about another <laughs> universe, you could go two ways. You could be really good or really no, fucking no, bad. No, no, it's only bad. I don't, you think I don't so? Want to imagine what another universe Elijah's doing. Right I now, think bro. there's a really good Elijah out there in the Single universe. Single cone right now during the summer of this, where girls. Nigga, I survived and, COVID. And listen, I'm not listen, wearing a my, condom. You survived COVID eight times. Eight times. <laughs> <laughs> see this. Uh, Allegedly, uh, nigga. Th yeah, this yeah. shit. Right. I remember <laughs> when COVID first came. I was wilding when COVID was first introduced. Yeah. And I was still, I was still on my, on my. Oh yeah, you shit. was wilding, bro. This wow. is the news is out. COVID's out in the air. That didn't stop my flow. I was still at the strip club. I was yeah, still. Yeah, I remember. I remember you was raw, still there. big wilding, big wilding. So now it's released. Uh, uh I couldn't. Nah, man. Nah, like that. I don't know. Like I survived COVID. There's no way you could have got me to wear a condom this summer. <laughs> Like there's no oh, way get this you could not <laughs> beg me. We go, we go even this out. Munir loves you so much. All right, Munir. All right, Munir, watch this episode. I don't even know what to she say. She go understand, <laughs> nigga. You gotta understand. Like, why nah, the fuck? I look, I I've just, been wearing a mask for a whole year. Why I'm wearing a condom I, now? I, I'll say this: if you guys are liking like this summer to 2016, 2017, oh I was gosh. on some shit. Some, yeah. shit. some big shit. Yeah. And if my circumstance wouldn't have changed, you know, with my family and this and that, bro, and I yeah. was single, me, nigga, and. and, and Nigga. Oh yeah, twenty sixteen is when I lost my virgin. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This you lost in the twenty sixteen? Yeah. Yeah. How yeah. young is this? What the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> How old are what we? The fuck? <laughs> that was five years ago. How old that are was... we? Bro, what I swear fuck? I've been fucking since twenty eleven. Damn. See, I not even twenty twenty twelve. My twenty right twenty eleven. Man. Yeah. yeah. Say, what the fuck? <laughs> Bro, I I was having threesomes when you were breaking your. What is wrong with me? Is there something wrong with me? No, Maybe it's me. So. It's you because I know there ain't nothing wrong with me. There's no wrong. I was, I was. 2016. Yeah. Yo, one of actually one of the chicks I had. Like I said, I, I like extending the episodes a little bit. One of the chicks I had a in oh, uh, no. a, a Twa with. I saw her on live today, complaining to the internet about I know somebody misinterpreted her her quote. I don't know Which whatever you talking about. Don't say her name. I'm not going to say like her name, it. but I know what you're but talking about. You know what you're talking about, right? Yeah, I know exactly what you're talking and about. And I was just like, um, 
I was like, if y'all ever see me bitching to the internet, <laughs> call me. I, I'm not even gonna look. What I'm was the gonna, quote? What? What was the quote? You should I know. You should. You know who it is. You should is. know. I know. You know who it is. I'm not. Gonna I see. know. I've been asleep all day. Yeah. Yeah. He just I know. Yeah. I know who it is. What's going on? What's yeah. Going yeah. Up? But not I agree. If I if you if you see me bitching to the internet about yeah. some real life problems, man. Just call me. Call me. Call, call me and, and tell me, me to get the that. fuck off the internet, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Matter of fact, that. come to my house and put my phone on airplane mode. For real. <laughs> yeah. I said, wait. I said, I'm, I said, what? Who get? I'm. I'm sorry. What? That's Was funny. it about you? No. 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 no, no, no. no. This is another situation. I, I'm different. not discrediting her situation, but yeah, I am. I'm just discrediting like the fact that the internet is the place to. Yeah. Nigga, nobody on the internet like you. No. No. no, not, not you specifically. No, no, no. Fuck in that. You specific. Sense. In a general, no. <laughs> Nobody on the internet likes yeah. anybody. anybody else. Yeah, not really. And the internet just. I fuck with y'all. Yeah, but y'all still ain't commenting and subscribing, but whatever. Yeah, yeah. y'all love watching internet cli- uh, uh, Instagram clips. Yeah, but what are YouTube views? Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying. Where That's do all you I gotta say? Know? What are YouTube views? He got a he got a whole kid. Y'all letting this nigga go I out kid. I work hard as shit. You know what I mean? Work hard as shit so he can feed his family. Y'all could save him, but y'all not. Disrespectful. Oh my gosh. But and then look, look, they be on I gotta, your I gotta, Instagram. I gotta live where I work. You know what I mean? Bruh, That's crazy. I gotta live where I he work. He don't ever clock out. Terrible. Uh, man. He leave the house to clock in and then come back home and clock in again. Damn. In Jamaican. <laughs> A Jamaican nigga saying damn. <laughs> <laughs> That's how bad it is. But, look, but nah, uh, yeah, man, this summer, yeah. It's this summer about to do. Let me ask you guys a question. You guys ever sent, so with all this debauchery that's supposed oh. to happen. Oh, wait. Oh, keep going. Yeah. No. Wait, no, nigga, what? Because I was going to say, like, this summer, oh, wow, I've been sending so much shit, nigga. So much shit. PP pics? <laughs> <laughs> this I'd be getting so many nudes. Manier, I know this you don't summer. pay attention to me. You gonna be getting some? No, no, you gonna no, be no, sending no, no, them? No, I'm not sending. Oh, you shit. would have been getting. I, oh, yeah. This so what? What? what this make nigga would start our OnlyFans. Oh yeah, one hundred. This nigga would have started this would, the, this would have been with the summer. Dumb shirt with I the chain going. You know through. Yeah, I, I, I wouldn't be <laughs> with no draws, but with a crop top tee. Yeah, he'll have a shirt on with just the neck cut out with the with a crop top, and it would have been a crop top, bro. Do the thing, and it would have been a crop top. Yup. Speaking of crop tops, um, no, but um, fuck, I wish I would have picked. I wish you would have picked up, picked up on that. Oh, Whatever, nigga. Oh, crop tops, nigga. No, I'm sorry. Uh, nothing. Um, what's a good new picture? You guys ever see nudes? And I asked this because, like, this nigga brought up he would have got so many nudes, right? Yeah. Like, all this or fucking debauchery so coming. Nudes. Yeah. What is? I'm mad. I missed that. Shot. I think this right. is getting I want to know what that, right sh- that show that that shot I missed. Oh no! Nah, oh, fuck it's, it. Whatever. It's Anyways, fine. Go I was, I'm um, just gonna drive me crazy. I'm just gonna hit me when I'm in the bed tonight. Damn. Right. <laughs> what, what's, what makes for a good nude picture? A good nude. Well, good nude. Okay, and so think about the answer. Don't say titties. Like, no, 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 no. I, I, I put, I well. put some thought into this. <laughs> I mean, no. But okay. this is the thing. It's, it's spontaneous, flattering. It's ob- so there's different elements that go into it, right? So the first thing is when you're receiving it, right? So if it's a mid afternoon nude pic. It's more flattering because <laughs> two o'clock in the afternoon. Two o'clock in the afternoon, you're yes. not expecting it. Bust a wide open. You know, you. it's like boom. That that's the first part. The second part of it is the cute element of it. How much? How many drafts went into this? Now, sometimes you can date a chick who will send you a nude who's just like you know, <laughs> open door, you know, whatever, and Man. she just got. And like those are cool, but you have to be in that real dark, freaky bag. Close the butt cheeks and stick the coochie out. Let me see some shit like that. But then, but you know, but then there's an element of the new spoon. Make sure it's real. (laughs) But then, but then there's the flirty nude, which is the most important nude. That's where you're getting it. That's a flirty nude. The flirty nude is almost a Victoria's Secret ad, but she did the photography herself. It's the step away from OnlyFans that went strictly to you. There was. Little tricks. I know all the tricks the girls use. You know, they sit on their ass to make their on thighs the fucking, come out. Yeah, nigga. You know what I'm saying? They make they adjust that. They make sure one uh, bra right. strap a little bit. T- all that. So if they angle do themselves the one leg, right, the one leg right, thing, so they, they can sit their ass. The cheek. They're gonna yeah. sit their ass on the back of their heel, and they're gonna take this arm, the adjacent arm, curl it to make the titty pop out bigger. Hold on up. a side angle, they're gonna hide their face with the phone, and that <laughs> has all the angles. And you mix that in with the spontaneity. Mm. That's a perfect nude. Ephraim. This nigga Muhammad is taking sink ass pictures. 
in his <laughs> bathtub. Because <laughs> that shit was far too detailed. Yeah, right. They, these bitches in the it comments. Was, he said, you got to be at a 45 <laughs> degree <laughs> angle. Wait, wait. wait oh, run that. Run that. <laughs> kind of projecting that one. And no, <laughs> I, I'm telling you, I've, I, I've received a lot of nudes in my life. See, for me, I had different. to teach a girl how to oh, take a Oh, Mr. Nude bitches. To, to send to right. me. Oh, to, Mr. Bitches. Y'all talking but, about me? Yeah, no, That's what I'm saying. Nah, fuck you. You ain't even asking me questions. He just started fucking five years ago. I ain't talking to him. Don't talk to me. Oh but, shit! Yes, for me it's different, bro. A good nude for me, I it's the more raunchy the better, nigga. Mm-hmm. I want that shit bust wide open in just, my face. Just, I want to see what. Let, you let me on, give. On, let, let me, me give you one. Let me see the ball. I'm not phone. You're not doing that. Let me see what you had for dinner yesterday, nigga. You're not doing that. That's how much I want. I want to see what you Nah, fuck that. I want you to. I want you to think that I'm your gynecologist, right? And we doing a remote. And you doing a remote checkup? You want. This camera? Let me you give you a pap smear through my bro. phone. <laughs> this camera or this camera? I want to be able to smell what your shit smells like through my phone. You're That's what I need. I want to know whether I you cream you or squirt hey, stop, stop, or do both. Stop, stop, stop. The stop. <laughs> Yo, Ephraim, you've got to pay attention. This nigga keeps fucking up my clips. <laughs> now, I want you to hold the phone in one hand. So you're saying use, front- your, use your two fingers in your other hand. Yeah. yeah. Slowly. Yeah. yeah. Y'all some spread. sick niggas. <laughs> I want you to spread that shit apart and to hear that shit. Go, uh, no, no, yeah. no. I want to hear your shit clap through the camera, nigga. Nah, those I'm t- <laughs> I want to see your shit glisten yeah, when you got the flash y'all on it. I want to know the last time you went to the guy to college. <laughs> y'all, some sick niggas. <laughs> I don't know when the last time your period was. <laughs> This nigga said, "Do you eat on the I toilet know like the I color, do?" It's the color inside of your stomach. I, I, is. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta know how long you sit on the toilet for. That's how I want the <laughs> detail. I want the news. <laughs> Wait, I, nah, nah. What you size gotta, underwear there you wear? Has to be a flag. <laughs> there has to be. I, we oh, want to give a special, get... special shout out to all our female watchers and listeners yeah, out we there. We only we nasty like y'all. this to our girls. We, you know, Honestly. We, are, yeah. we truly yeah. appreciate but everything not, you've done. We then, hope y'all enjoy this stupid ass shit we do. But in all, in all seriousness. But there is an angle. There, Look, like I said, yeah, I, yeah, there I, I know the art. Like I'm saying See, there's an art like, to doing like, it. You like women to send you like, all right, I'm a model nude. You yeah. Know I don't want that. It ain't even got to be. Bro, listen, I'm going to be real. Like you can send me the arched back picture, you know. Like where you got the mirror right here, yeah, 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 and yeah, then yeah, you know yeah. she got the booty tooted up in this, and like, the right there. In the front, I like, like that, yeah, but the then you could also give me but the make close sure up. The light, make sure the lights on the right side so you can get. I the see jump you, on so you take pictures, nigga. Oh, that's, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. I want some raunch, nigga. No, I'm, I'm I want the raunchy shit like, too. I want her to hold the phone in one hand, bro, and then use the two fingers to spread. I, I want that. Yeah, I can't. I want it all, bro. Somehow I want you to work your face into the picture too. Nah, you ain't got to. I want face in my nudes. And Did that's that why make I think me a sick nigga? And I don't know uh, how you want the zoom in and the face. See? If she can trust you, go ahead. Send the face. Oh, she can trust me? Yeah. 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 This nigga wants the nudes where he sees his kid's face. <laughs> <laughs> you want the kid in the background <laughs> hey, hey, at the door. Hey, I'm not don't say lie. nothing. Don't say don't, nothing. Don't. One time, I don't even want to hear this one shit. One time? No. Back during my, my days, yeah. I was messing around with this Way girl. Way long ago. Long ago. Long, long, man, it was dark yeah. ages. ages. Like 2008. Electricity yeah. wasn't even invented yet, exactly, bro, right? Exactly, exactly. She had the little candle lit next to her, oh, right? Oh, yeah, I get you. I get but you. I asked her, to, like Snapchat, I asked her to send me some shit, bro, right? Yeah. And we was cool, it was cool, it was cool, it was cool. Nigga, and she sent me one, nigga, her kid was sleeping in the bed next to her G while she was doing her thug dizzle. Oh, see? I don't know how to feel about that because I wanted. Isn't that like I sexual to, assault? Bro? I wanted to see the thug thizzle, right? But on the other hand, their kid was right there. I could see the kid in the shots. <laughs> You're horrible. I had to just like, nah, mom. Yeah. Said, you gotta do it again. <laughs> oh my God. You gotta do it again. Nah. You can't do that. Yeah, you can't do that. Nah. All right, all right, so we talking all this crazy shit about what we want from them. The nudes you sent. What, what's a, what, what's a great what's a good dick? How do you take a good dick picture? I can speak on this. Let, yeah, I've let been the, told I have a pretty dick. Yes, the ambassador. Of we, you don't have to sell that. Pretty dick gang, you feel me? Pretty penis party. P P P. The real P P P. Pretty penis party. You feel me? <laughs> don't, don't look even, at me like that. I don't that. even know. <laughs> look how you hold it. Yeah, up. that's how it sits. <laughs> my, dick like my dick look like this. <laughs> oh, Stop looking basement. at me like that. This nigga think he in the basement. Man, bro, <laughs> I, I, Rap I city. I don't understand. I, 
All right, all right, but how do, you, how do you take a good one? All right, man. During the day, you know, you want to have your window open so you catch that sun ray hitting off the head of your dick. So when you take it, she think it's the Statue of Liberty or some shit, and she just in awe at the scenery <laughs> of yo me. Munir, please watch this episode. We, we asked I don't this. want I your you sister to watch me talking about remember. my we dick. We asked for this. Yeah, we did. We did. Now, now, if it's late at night, you got to make sure you have some type of light on. If you dark skin, I don't know if you got a white PP. I don't know how that go. But <laughs> you got a dark dick. I know you got to have a light on. Otherwise, it's just going to look like you send in a shadow. So <laughs> <laughs> she was like, why you send me your direct TV remote? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was funny. <laughs> 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 I don't want to see this shit. I got dish. But oh, <laughs> no. that, was, that was yo, that, that was, was good. <laughs> <laughs> but it, hold on, hold on. Another oh, thing. Shit, Make funny. sure your dick is moisturized. Oh. You don't want to be sending an ashy dick pic. Yeah. Cause she not gonna be hype about that. She gonna be like, why is this Bro, nigga dick ashy? And you never want your dick to be ashy because it's hard to explain <laughs> that, it, that it's ashy. And she like, what's like, wrong with your you, dick? Like, it's not wrong with it. It's just ashy. Well, nah, look at <laughs> you. Don't never want your dick to be ashy because you don't have to explain. Bro, why you don't want to have ashy. one no, blemish no. on your no. dick. You no, need to do like a three, nah, like listen, a three listen, over, listen. nigga. Let's, yeah. call, let's call it. Let's call it spade a spade. There's only one reason your dick ashy. That means you've been beating your shit. Nah. Oh, no, no. Just shower. get out the shower, yeah, nigga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's something wrong shit. with this, nigga. No, 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 no. You no, literally no. be choking the yeah. shit out your dick. Wait, bitch. Wait, You said what? That nigga be home wearing bar shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, it's because you got the shower, but you don't never want to have to explain to somebody like why your dick is ashy because it's never a good look. That's facts. Yeah. And if you got an ingrown hair, bro, wait that two weeks to send man, a dick pic. You gotta, or you send an old dick pic, you feel oh, me? Oh, no. Yeah, yeah, bro. bro. You, you got a window. 100%. I learned that. You got a window between the shave and when you send the dick pic. Mm -hmm. Because that, that window is... Like seventy two hours. You yeah, before you know you whether it was a good shave yeah, or, or a bad an, one. You gotta shave and take as many pictures as you can yeah. that day. <laughs> just in case, two days later, you wake up to a surprise. And then get it, get one in the morning just in case. Just in case, you gotta get some day pics. You gotta get some night pics. Yeah, I've, I don't know. I've never. I haven't sent. Have a you dick said, pic. Yeah, have I haven't you sent, sent a dick pic in. Bro, in, since 2012. God. Seriously? Yeah. Wow. I'm not, I'm Why? Never, you just don't don't like doing it? No. Like, I mean, I've had my dick on on camera. Like, that she was she was naked. Count. Yeah, I was that naked, and we just like that's porn. It God. was quarantine, <laughs> nigga. The fuck oh, else? We that's porn. <laughs> yeah. That doesn't count. <laughs> <laughs> we ain't wow. shit else to do. So. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. So, you, mm. but other than Wait, that, it's been a while since I've sent a picture of my dick to anybody. Hold up. Has your dick ever been uh, used in a video? Yeah, like okay. I've taken a video for okay. my yeah all the yeah. time. No, 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 no. Not like in the sense you have, nigga. Oh. I'm not a whore. <laughs> what about you? I feel like you have. I'm not a whore. No, I've never got. Ah, wow. uh, you have gotten paid. Okay, yes. I have gotten paid. Yeah. I've gotten paid for sex before. I've ah, never been gang. Paid. Yeah, I've that's what good paid. dick gets you. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know what you're out there. I got 150 dollars. <laughs> See, wow, $150. they paid you 150 dollars to have dollars. sex with them. Yeah. <laughs> like not your girlfriend Like just here man Here's some money Like they yeah, said Hey man I wanna fuck I, you I'll pay to I, fuck no, you No as a joke I was like it's 150 She was like Oh yeah Seriously I was like oh, yeah Oh man $100 150 about. Gang I gave it up for free All the time Fuck that <laughs> I don't value myself for <laughs> You don't bro <laughs> You out here giving free I dick? This dick <laughs> oh, no, <laughs> nigga. Oh, Kendrick. Nigga. Kendrick <laughs> looking at this nigga mad. He's That's like, what I tell y'all niggas? I said but this yeah. dick ain't free. No, I haven't sent a dick pic in a long time. The thing is, I like sending dick pics. It makes me feel like good about myself. Especially after I you said one. You sound like the naked girls on Instagram right now. Okay. I don't do it for okay. them. I understand I really, it. I really don't. I get it. I really, I just, it makes me feel good about myself that somebody wants like a digital copy of my dick. Do you know see, what I mean? See, no, but all right. I mean, <laughs> see, that's because he's not a part of PPP. You ain't got your PPP. <laughs> no, I ain't got it. We don't have that. Me no have that. I only agree with him. Yeah. Because <laughs> it makes me look good. <laughs> yeah, Unattended. I, yeah, I, I, I have not. Oh, I've never, I haven't sent my dick, like, not to my knowledge. I can't not think it, of it. So you don't send dick pics to your girl now? No, I send dick pic to my girl. 
Yeah, no. Nah, I she, do. I have. Yeah, see? Like, I have. I have a lot, actually. Spice it up a bit. You feel me? I've even asked her to do. send me nudes, too. I would have a lot of explaining to do if I see yeah, that's, unsolicited see, dick pic to, to my your girl. girl. Mine's not unsolicited, yeah. even though, like, it, technically it is solicited Suck. all the time. Yeah. At this point, it is all the For time. For you, yes, it is. You know what I mean? Could be potentially made. It is. It's not 1950. I can't, I can't <laughs> imagine a scenario where, like, I send her a picture of my dick and she, like, hates me for it. I can. I can. I can. I can. I can. See, when you first, run. second, third day of that period. Yeah. I think that shit is funny. Oh. I wish I could just, like, first day of work. She Pop. <laughs> While she at her job. <laughs> Why the fuck? See, that's not even funny. <laughs> that's, that's not even funny. It's funny because, like, it's just funny to me because just imagining, like, the whole scenario of, like, oh, shit, this is so, a dick on my phone. Me and my girl, we used to have this thing. I told her, I'm going to send you a rocket emoji anytime I'm about to send a dick pic. That's a good little warning. Yeah. That's a good you warning. You feel me? That's you send system. the rock, but I'm not going to lie. Did there are times I that, forgot. Did you sent that shit to Ephraim, too? <laughs> You know, it's Pride Month. Hell yeah, I did. <laughs> reverse, reverse, reverse. <laughs> Ephraim just, hey, man. Now I got to be ready for it. <laughs> yeah, right? You got to stay ready with your mic in your hand. <laughs> no, not, you can't say that. Let's not, forget, let's not forget this nigga Mo was walking around talking about meat to meat contact. Oh, he for day. sure was. He woke up this morning and he said, hey, <laughs> take that rubber off. <laughs> me to me. That was called me gay when I was ah. saying that shit. No, no we was, weren't. You were singing that, and then it got to this nigga. He was singing it. Ah. Then it got to me, and then I was singing it, and then this nigga calls me gay. It's already gone <laughs> to three degrees. Yeah. I don't understand how that works. It's the context you used it in, man. I was doing. You literally dishes. had your dick out in the middle of the let's, kitchen. Let's stay talking about uh, talking about. Wait, you, had, hey, you had your dick out in the yes, middle of the kitchen. Yes, bro. He was like, I took yeah. that rubber off. Talk about me, me to, to me. me. With your me out to me, ah, wild dog in the air. Me to me. I pray. Me. I pray this is not the episode. Me. He took some uh, some turkey bacon and wrapped it around his <laughs> turkey. <laughs> he said this shit not salty enough. <laughs> I hate y'all. I don't have to see. I'm about to bird man this shit. <laughs> this is, hey, I feel yeah, a roast session coming. You know how sick this nigga Muhammad is. <laughs> This nigga feet so big, he can foot fuck himself. Ah. <laughs> this that nigga give himself his own life. foot job. Right, well, on on that note, we gonna push him forward. I can't. That was funny. <laughs> All right, got it. So, <laughs> Mo, you, you, you pay attention to the news. Yes, know. yes. Any, anything newsworthy enough for us to talk about? Since yes, yes. After all uh, this fucking. So let's actually formally introduce this after a horrible meat to meat discussion. <laughs> meat, meat to meat. meat. <laughs> Dirty bitch. Take that rope off. <laughs> as we like to say, as you guys very well know in the audience out there, we like to discuss things that are hip hop. Ephraim, tell me that camera hasn't budged a little bit. Everything straight over there? Here. All right, it's making sure it looks a little crooked, but whatever. You look a little crooked. <laughs> I have. You for sure do look a little crooked. We are <laughs> crooked cops trying to catch them fast. Yeah. <laughs> we are a hip hop show, contrary me to all. Me to me, <laughs> me to me. Happy Pride Month to everybody out there. Month. Happy Pride Month. <laughs> you know, Lil Nas X, come on the show. Lil Nas X, please come hey, on the I, show. Yeah, that'd be a great show. That would yeah. be a great yeah. show. I, saw I him need on, that on nigga Jimmy to Kimble. roast all y'all niggas. Nah, that, he can't roast me. That nigga got. That nigga Mo got go meat tattooed on his lip. <laughs> I tell Lil Nas X he had nigger lips. So, <laughs> as our show, wow. uh, <laughs> this He's is a bad episode. About Rose, nigga, like. this, this, this is a, this is a bad episode. Oh, Lil Nas X, come on, it's, 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 it's a great a, episode, honestly. Yeah, it's, 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 a, it's, a, it's a, we got, it's a one of these. We got, a, we got a little it taste of fame, like, and we just started losing. Oh, all, like, they want to see us go crazy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, y'all like that? Watch this. <laughs> um, Start checking the job. <laughs> 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 but we like I, to right. discuss. We like to discuss things that are hip hop. You know, yeah. that's the whole reason why we put together this whole show because right. we discuss pop culture, fucking hip hop music, yada yada. So I think it's important that we open up this new series. The name hasn't been titled yet, but we want to talk about things that are hip hop that aren't necessarily hip hop. Right. So we'll call it bird watching for now. No. no oh. The, oh, not that. Oh, oh shit. My bad. <laughs> you did a terrible job. I'm sorry. That's your segment. That's your. My bad. Segment. My bad. My bad. You already called bird watching. Rory, I'm sorry. <laughs> Anyways, 
So, anyways, we want to talk about something that has been dope, has been really hip hop, and I want to cover Naomi Osaka. Oh, Fucking okay. Naomi Osaka, even though she kind of retracts some of it, but it's okay. I still stand by her. You know um, why she had to do that? Yeah, forty million. Uh-huh. Nigga. Honestly, bro, forty million. Up, she's trying to set up the forty mil for the next year, okay, right? Yeah. But um, but yeah, her telling the uh the U.S. Open or French Open, excuse me, to fuck off because of my mental health, mm-hmm. bro. I I I literally heard like the power instrumental. Honestly, bro. When I was reading that, oh, I was yeah. like, "Oh, uh, yeah, right." Hey! Oh. Uh, like, bro, it was the dopest thing for me because I, I did not, I never thought that I would see a day where like fucking young kids is telling like these major corporations, exactly. like, "Fuck off, bro!" Like, fuck I gotta off. Work, look I need out for to myself. Be, I have to look out for myself, <clears throat> so I, bro. Like that, I really had nothing more extenuous to say on that, but I, I just thought that it was just a really cool moment for him, like her being. And shout out to Corday. You know, for being the right. boyfriend and and I'm hoping supporting that yeah. decision. I mean, he's got but, everybody else supporting it. Right, right, to, right, right. Very, like you said, it's a very hip hop move. It's it's yeah. not crazy to see rappers or whatever just like you know what, man. I'm gonna take a step back from the spotlight, work on myself, fuck what the fans want, J. fuck Cole. what this want, J. fuck Cole. what everybody want. And you don't really see that too much in sports, not right. really. Right, right, right. Actually, uh, give us another example. The one place I will say is. I don't know, the most hip hop of all sports, basketball. Who took time off from mental health? Um, Kyrie, but also oh, yeah, Kevin yeah. Love. Yeah, Kevin but Love. Even with Kyrie, like he's a very I don't want to say he's outspoken. A, yeah, he's a very outspoken individual. Yeah, you know people have problems with him anyways. Yeah. But Ky, um, Kevin Love, yeah. it's a white man. Yeah, big white man too. Yeah. Um, he came out. He spoke on his mental health. Um. He said that he couldn't play certain games because his headspace wasn't right. He was yeah. battling, dealing with anxiety, depression. Yeah. And then you have players like Carl Anthony Towns. His mother just passed away from COVID. Right. And he's expected to play a full on season with, you know, without going through shit. So. Right. Right. It's great to see like these athletes sticking up for themselves. Yeah. It, yeah. I think it's actually adding a lot. I think it's adding just the lifespan of these, of, I'm saying of these athletes, but mm-hmm. of the athlete's it, career. It's, it's adding a adding, human ele- element. Yeah. Which I think adds value to the actual, like, hell yeah. Yeah, to because the whole thing. As, as somebody who's famous or whatever, you're like, not us as fans, but fans yeah. in general, we don't consider these people to be human in a right. sense where we, sometimes we just that. want them to just work, 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 yeah, work. Yeah, because you work. just see the talent and you're just like, okay. Well, you're that talented. Nothing could be wrong with you. Exactly. Right. Now you see that they're that talented. Or that successful. Oh, okay, exactly. Now you see they're that talented dealing with these same human emotions. Yeah. And still able to go out there and perform at the greatest level ever. Period. It's really Period. inspiring. Yeah, right. it's, exactly. And it was, I, what I like most about Naomi is that she's not saying this as like some D-list tennis player. No. Bro, she's no. the top of the top. Like, like she be serene. Her, her saying that I'm not returning until I'm, I don't have to, like... Is almost the it, it would put it and I, I'm a, this take isn't from me I kind of heard it I heard it on Joe Budden but he said it would kind of like put a damper whoever wins because it'd be yeah. like yeah you won but, but exactly Naomi didn't play if Naomi <laughs> would have been there yeah, right could have so, been rap for you yeah. so that's what I'm saying like I really do like I really do like the stance this woman is taking because like anybody who who says fuck you to the system. Obviously, you got my attention. And yeah, yeah. yeah. honestly, if you yeah. say fuck you to the system, bro. I'm your number one fan. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So it, you know, it, and and be sure you guys send us in some clips or something that you think is hip hop. You think is deemed as hip hop because we would love to talk about it. DM one of us. DM one of us. Big Wolf W L W. Uh, Augusto or Cone dot Augusto. Excuse me. Hot boy Heems. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, how many E's? That's it. Hot boy Heems. That's it. How many E's is in it? Two E's. That's oh, okay. It. Yeah, it. Hot yeah. boy Heems. All yeah. right. Because we would love to cover some more stories. We'd love to. And we'd love to see what's on y'all mind. We can't talk about dicks all the time. No, we Not can't. all the time. Like I mean, as we as can't. As much as <laughs> but y'all Mo like do it. it. And it's entertaining. <laughs> we can't do that. Yeah. But, um, but speaking of more on like hip hop culture, you know, I want to talk about uh, bird watching. This bird watching. What's going on on the socials? Man. So. Y'all remember Layaway? Layaway, like the system where you don't buy it, but yeah, you gotta like buy some of it. Down yeah, and yeah. Then every month put a little bit more yeah, down. Yeah, yeah. That's still a thing. Yeah, yeah. Walmart is business because of layaway, nigga. You know, Walmart do layaway? Yeah. <laughs> so now yeah. there are actually these other services like for pay. What's wrong or, with your voice? I, I don't know. <laughs> like, it's a little raspy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, you ain't be hearing yeah. me say <laughs> all this. This is his official voice. He's yeah, got to officially yeah. pro- professionally. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah no issue. It's for the white people. Yelling his dick, yelling the dick joke. Me to me. Y'all, all of a sudden, his voice is back. <laughs> but anyways, I was talking about too much dick. It was too much dick it. in my throat, bro. Like, come on, I want to know. Who the <laughs> <laughs> Gotch, bitch. <laughs> nah, but um, so ah. I was like, <laughs> 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 was that at? <laughs> for real, for real. Nah, but I was on Twitter and uh, um, there's this uh, a few services like Afterpay, Forpay, and shit like that, Bruh. where My you girl can loves do, that shit. bro, you can do installment payments on dope Everything. shit. Supreme, yeah. Um, Goat has it. I'm pretty sure um, a lot of stock places exa- have it. That, a that's lot like of places. an option to check out. Exactly, yeah. Yeah. and you know it's based off of layaway for payments. They check your. They do a small credit check. Of but course, nothing that'll damage your credit. Have you ever used it? I have. You have. Okay. I've copped. How about you? A pair of nah. shoes. Uh, yeah, I, I have. I don't really. A pair I, don't, of shoes I don't like ordering shit online. I hate ordering shit online, bro. Yeah, bro. you don't like waiting. No, I, I don't like waiting, and I don't like. I like to try shit on, bro. Mm. And mm. I don't. I, you can't try shit on if it's online, bro. Because if it doesn't work, nigga, then you have to send it back. And yeah, and you know what I mean. It's I know. Be three months mm. before you get your shirt. That's yeah. true. But anyways, but, you're right. but um, there was a woman on Twitter talking about, oh, y'all really out here using Afterpay and shit like that. Yeah, y'all really broke. Y'all don't have y'all priorities together. And it had me thinking. What is wrong with seeing that, yo, this thing costs this amount of money, let's yeah. say $215. I could pay, you know, a few installment fees of like $60, pay, end up paying like 240 or some shit like that, and still get the same thing. But it doesn't hurt my pockets all the way right now. So this is what I, I'm going to tell you the same thing I told my girl, because my girl's addicted to Afterpay, yeah. right? It's still debt. It is still debt. It's still debt. And even though you don't recognize it as that, and that's that's the genius behind Afterpay, mm-hmm. like you'd be like, oh, well, if I can have three installments of $40 and only putting 40 down, I can get it now, then you're you're accepting the fact that you're going to put, you're going to still be $120 in debt. And you don't want to add that to. You, you just, just don't want to be in debt yeah. like that right away. I told her this is the true genius in Afterpay. If niggas are getting shit at Afterpay and flipping it and mm-hmm. making money, which and then is what some niggas are, do. Okay, okay. Yeah, that's what some right. niggas because you gotta genius. look at it. Cause you cop a let's say you cop a shoe on um Grailed stock or Grailed whatever. Stock X or GOAT, right? Yeah. Use GOAT. Um you can get that shoe and probably flip it for Maybe a hundred dollars more, yeah. If you're around somebody that's willing to pay that, right, right, right. Now they just help you pay that shit off, and you just got a hundred dollars, right, right. That's smart. That's I think that's genius. That's I think genius. If, if you're flipping, then after yeah. pay, yeah. Sense. But even like if you're using it in the sense of yeah, I have all the money right now, but you know what? Let me just go ahead kick this sixty dollars and save the rest, and you know. Maybe it looks good on my credit. Maybe. I don't know. I just, I, I, I like Afterpay if it's only for profit. Like, I don't. Yeah. See, I, I don't. But think about a laptop, man. I bought that shit cash. No, no. But think yeah, about some. That shit straight, yeah. straight cash. Straight cash. Yeah. Straight cash. Cash, yeah. Apple boy. Shout out to our plug, man. nigga. We got the same cash. plug. Yeah. Nigga, we got the I got same baby plug. Straight cash. Nigga. <laughs> 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 baby straight cash. But I'm with you. I like to I maybe it's just like the pride in me or whatever, you know what I mean? Yeah. I like to buy shit straight up. It's the security, bro. And if you I like, can't, then I'll just wait till I get the money to do it. It's yeah. the security like, you straight, like, yeah. well, I mean I don't know. It's I'd just rather in, wait. in in America, like I've just I've, that's what my mom always told me. She's like in America, like we're and not in a bad sense, we're like obsessed with debt. Yeah. We're obsessed like things we don't because think about bro, it. Do even you know how much the, uh, debt America is, is in, bro? It's crazy. Trillions. Like trillions. They and have no interest in returning. They, like, they're no, literally like, about they're, they're like us. <laughs> literally. Cause nigga. I've never been my you know what I mean? <laughs> they're like <laughs> I'm, I'm just, you they know? literally <laughs> listen, listen. You I, said nothing, but I, I knew I, that I, whole. Listen. I didn't want to say it out loud because yeah. I don't want people to be like, "Oh, they, this nigga, oh, this nigga yeah, right? he got his priorities it's fucked up." Him. Yeah, right. but um, like think of it. They like over like how much? Two hundred trillion dollars. Yeah, it's trillion, debt. bro. Yeah, and they hear that and they like. <laughs> so what else uh, you trying to buy, nigga? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so really. yeah and, that shit crazy. I don't, yeah. I don't know. I, I still think I, I think this is a good discussion. I but do you a, think I like think it's a good discussion about finances and but, us and our finances? But yeah. I understand that. But do you think it's okay to call somebody broke because they choose to use that? 
Instead of just buying it Women all Women will call right? a nigga broke for, for anything. Every, yeah. Any reason. That's the real discussion. You know what I mean? Y'all pulling the broke yeah, card. Okay, on yeah, any... because that's all this Twitter. Uh, that's all this theme. It's around $200 dates. Yeah. It's around. See? And that, that's like the discussion we had a while ago. Do you buy bro. your girl a Rafe the y'all second and anniversary? Said if, if my man start asking me to pay half the rent, I'm going to call him a broke bitch. And listen. Right. It's Can the you same, even based afford? all the same shit. Let's, so what are you... Go like on, in that on. sense, okay. He asks you for the half, half the rent. You say no because he's broke. He's like, all right, you're right. I pay the whole thing. Can you get the bills at least? Yeah. Can you get groceries? Right. Yeah, it, it's. I'm sorry. Buy- I know you kind of went into that, but I just want to close on afterpay. You mm-hmm. fucking dumbass. If you go on a date with somebody and they put it on their credit card, that's afterpay. Yeah. Credit, yeah. nigga. Credit. Credit. So she just dumb as hell. All right, cool. But now going back to the original discussion. Oh, and actually, that yeah. was another topic. Oh, okay. Some girl was like, if I go on a date with you and see you pull out a credit card, you're broke. Oh, she's just that dumb as hell. That doesn't even make fucking she's sense. Dumb as hell. That doesn't even make fucking sense. I'm about to put my Kevin Samuel suit on. Oh, my. God. No, we, we should have a segment. We <laughs> no, no, we good. We should have a segment where you do that one day. <laughs> but not like, let's, <laughs> let, let's uh, like really dive deeper into this. Right? <laughs> like, where is this coming from? Like, who is taking care of these so, women to where they think? I bro, so I was watching um, Adam Twenty Two and um, what's the guy? I can't remember his name. The one who went off on Kanye at TMZ, the brother. Yeah, yeah I know you're talking oh, about. Oh, Van Lathan. Van Lathan. Van Lathan and Adam Twenty Two had a great interview. And Van Lathan, come on the show. Van Lathan, please come on the show. If you see this clip, my brother, come sit down right. <laughs> you here don't want us. Van Lathan on the show. Don't want that nigga on the show. <laughs> no. <laughs> Please, please come please. on. The show. <laughs> I don't want that, that nigga will give you an organized argument on why Kanye was tripping. Right. And he wasn't tripping uh, though. Uh, he wasn't tripping. Save it for Van. Save, Save it for when. He wasn't tripping. Save, Save it for when Van comes. Yeah, Van, we can't wait to see you, bro. But anyways, so he was talking about. He was like, "Look, this is a." He's like, "Here we are talking about the ha- the habits of women and the habits of men, all trying to flex up to look like Instagram. Like everyone, he's like, bro." Back in the day, Adam Twenty Two talks about. I didn't realize how much of a metalhead fucking Adam Twenty Two is. Like, <laughs> look at him. I know. I don't want to. Yeah. Because I see so much hip hop. I was like, he can't be a metalhead. But he was like, yeah. He back in bikes. like the nineties and two thousands, he was like, it was common for your favorite band to have a day job. Mm, like you would wild. go like Metallica. Like don't let that shit fool you. Metallica. They all worked. To, they worked in the same. Like they worked together. Really. They were coworkers. Really. See. Yeah. And it was like for some reason. As Instagram has presented this facade, we're all supposed to be fucking successful and winning. And just, we're all uh, supposed to be uh, making six figures. Making right six now. figures right. off of our talents, and it doesn't work like that. He said what happened was that sense of entitlement. Instagram gave us followers, and followers was gave us entitlement. And entitlement is what created all these BBLs at 19. See, look, look don't, don't talk too much about it because the next topic, next yeah. episode, I want to talk about people don't realize how hard it is to be successful and all sense of the word. Yeah. Because like just like you said, bro, Instagram, Twitter yeah. has created these false sense of, of success. Yeah. And and what it means to be successful or classify what being successful is. Right. And do you and think that's where a lot of these women's like, hell yeah. tropes with yeah. Yeah. Hell, yeah. hell yeah, bro? It, because we see people on Instagram no. flex the fuck out of everything. Whether it be theirs or not, we don't fucking know. Right. All we see is a fucking square. Right. You see, know that's what why I mean? it's always or good. Or a ten eighty by thirteen fifty portrait. That's what I'm saying. Or a ten eighty by thirteen. That's why it's always good to great. you know <laughs> focus on yourself. Self, man honestly Focus no, don't exit yet keep oh, going yeah. don't exit no, that's what i'm saying yeah keep and calling it, these niggas stupid yeah it's not even stupid bro it's like it i said bro they they all these false sense of of riches mm-hmm. and women take that and they see that and they see these women being treated like this and that now they expect us like the regular niggas like us to come with that same fucking energy mm-hmm. right right right, you right. Know, if you're not paying all my bills then i have no business talking to you and you right. know what's crazy about that bro like a lot of these rappers they be paying for their girl shit with the label money <laughs> not even they money. And a deal that that's not even theirs. So it's, it's it's the run on of a front. So bring it back to afterpay. What's wrong with afterpay? That's good. It's like it's not. It's like that's not. It's not real. I tell I I tell my girl all the time. I was like, it seems like, it, whatever. It's gonna come off misogynistic, but like, seems like. Y'all women are in a competition. Is look who who's gonna look the most carefree? Yeah. Like if we're in the competition as it's, men, if we're if the male competition to be like, look, I got the most power. Then y'all having a competition on see who I'm more carefree than you. Yeah. Look how less work I have to do. Exactly. So it's a competition of those. It's like it's it's laziness on two different spectrums. 
It's laziness from the men's behalf because you want to look as if you have success, but you didn't want to put in the work. Mm -hmm. But it's laziness on the woman's behalf because look at what all, this man who's supposedly worked hard gave you. Like, exactly. it's the women's competitions of the carefree is a sick fucking game that I don't understand. Like, even like, I, bro, it was so crazy. Like, I, I got on, like, if you. Baby, you I love you. Yeah, time you know with that shit. I really was. I said, ba baby, I love you. Let me just give a preface. Like, when she was doing her poses, and it was like, it was the. <laughs> like, what's you wrong with, like, what's, I said, you're not that happy. And like, yeah. So I started giving like these poses sounds so then she can start realizing yeah. what like this, this story she's telling. Like, look, I'm more carefree than you. Look how high my hand is. Right, you know, right. like, see, you can tell. And I was like, why? Like, there's there's nothing wrong in just posting, you know, like and your normal, your everyday life. I don't know. I don't nah, know. People like see being real as the new fake because you'll be your real authentic self. Yeah. And it'll throw people off. They'll be like. Whoa! Right, I'm saying it's it's a, it's a race on two fronts. Like yeah. women, like you said, as most carefree. I don't need a man. This and this and that. But on the nigga side, bro, is well, I got the most money. Right, I got, I got the, the most money, flexes. and I could do the most. With, with, with putting mean? the least amount of work. With the yeah. least amount of work, right. exactly. Yeah. That's that's the, the full people story. People who really work hard for this. They shit, don't bro. have time to do Shout that. Shout out to all my construction workers. Shout out to all hey. my field workers. Nigga, Shout they, out to everybody who's out in that hot ass sun. Nigga, nigga, working, making their money. Nigga. Still easy. paying taxes somehow, <laughs> nigga. nigga. That shit is not fucking It's easy. not easy. It's not fun to wake up at 6 a.m. No. And go try to feed your family. It's right. not fun, but some nigga got to do it. Do you think it's ever going to get reversed? Uh, I don't know, man. No. The American dream, when you think about it, the American dream is getting a loan. Cause Keep going. Get it. The American dream. I got to get a mortgage on my house. You know, I got to get a house. Mm -hmm. In order to get a house, you got to get a mortgage. You got to get a bank loan. I got to get a car. I got to have the Fly's car. All right. You got to get a bank loan from the bank. I have got to have a great wedding. Most of the time, you got to have a loan to get the ring, engagement ring, the wedding ring, and pay for the whole fucking wedding. The American dream is really set up to get loans. Like, keep niggas in debt. Yeah, man. Do whatever what the fuck you want to do. do. Literally. Find some shit that so makes you, you happy. So what? So I, I would really wish there was a button we can hit where we can all. That's why uh, me and Lota had a discussion. We said I wish everybody can have the how much money they have float above their head, like ooh, the Isaiah Rashad ooh, video. Ooh, ooh. Oh, it, I didn't know the video. Squad. Oh, I didn't know. Ooh. I didn't know. I I, I really ooh. do wish where everyone talked. Where had a list of all their assets well, and I don't how much know cash they have. Like that. I, and I, I wouldn't care. I'm broke. Do you think it would ever get to a point though where you could just walk by somebody, see their number, and really not give a fuck though? No. You don't ever think I that? don't think humans. No, because then, no, because then if, if everybody had their number on the top of their head, uh, it would come to a point where people who had a bigger number wouldn't talk to anybody with a little number. Mm. And then they would start grouping those people and like like it already happens now. Yeah. Yeah. They would start grouping those people in a society where if they have below $10 and shit, then they ain't shit. Right, right, right. Like I said, American society is, is set up, bro, on classism. That'd be That's fucked up from drug dealers, nigga. One week, that should say negative $32. Next week, right? $54,000, <laughs> nigga. That, that, that's that's yeah. how shit runs is classism, Yeah, bro, you're you know right. I mean? Yeah, it is classism, and, if, and if it's not money, it's materialistic. If it's yeah. not materialistic, and it's, it's, all a it's, it's everything else. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's all so, a part of the same monster. So, so and and that's why I was like, I want to know when we're going back to our original discussion, the where the women or... Cause I don't really hear guys talk about I'm gonna give me a girl that takes care of me or whatever. I don't. Really but that's it. see that that's the thing. That's not what that's not oh. the stamp that society has given us. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's not normal for somebody for a man to be like, dang, I got I got to get with a woman who could pay my rent, who could buy my car. And that's not normal. It's right, normal right, for right. us as men to be the provider. Speaking so go on out, that, I heard a Travis Scott bar. First, don't Travis, lose that. Don't lose no, that no, sentence. No, no, no. First Travis bar, I've ever heard. Can't fuck with a bitch unless she can cover the lease on my Beamer. Yeah, you know. Louboutins don't rock. <laughs> Louboutins don't touch my hoe. And I was like, damn, nigga. So <laughs> you was really a nigga that had the mindset that these bitches going to pay for me. And then it makes me fast forward to this Kardashian shit. Mm. And how this nigga blew up and had all these Nike deals and stuff. And I'm like, maybe, mm. maybe you should let her pay your mm. way, nigga. Nah, because you, you, it, it's funny because... Excuse me. Like I said, it's not the stamp on us is to be mm. the provider, right? Yeah. Right. It's to come through, pay bills, pay this, do this, this, and this, and that. Yeah. But if the shoes on the other way, on the other foot, bro, when like mm. your girl is up, bro, yeah. nigga, you're up. Like, like 
nobody's ever seen. Right. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like girl going Corday up. You. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Corday is up. Corday is up. He is up. He's up. Yeah. In a different sense than if he was to be up and she was. You know what right. I mean? It's just I don't know. Society says men have to be provided, so it's on us to go out, get the job, get the money, pay yeah. for all the shit. So we're under that pressure of having to work our ass off just so you know the girl can go out and do. But this you and know that. what's fucked up about that? Like most men, they'll be in that position and they'll resent it. And I think I think the majority of men resent that. Yeah, yeah, they'll I resent think, it. I think how, let's talk percentage. I'm how many? How many percentage of a hundred men? Yeah, I'm saying ninety five of them. You think? Ah, I don't think. I don't, I don't, don't think, think, think so. I, think I honestly, like I, I say sixty five. I say a hard like seventy five. I think more than half. More than yeah, we more can all agree on that. Sure. More yeah. than yeah. half resent yeah. the fact that they're the ones who have to be the providers. Yeah. yeah, and if they're not, then they get looked down upon. Right. I, I that was like literally just to tie back into like the beginning part of the episode where I told you like where I talked to my my girl's dad. Yeah. And he's like, well, let me have this discussion with you. You know, women like to be comfortable. And then mm-hmm. the first sentence he follow up right after was he's like, well, I he told me that he believes that you can still live off of one income. He's like, I understand it's how hard. You, but yeah. and, and, he, and it was like, well, from what? Like, it's hard. But I was like. I, it made me wonder. I was like, I wonder if he's saying that to his daughter. Like, I, I wonder, is, is that the pitch I'm getting? You know, I have no knock against him. I Like I said, yeah, I love that man, you yeah. know, but. And I was like, dang, here, here I didn't well, even start yet, bro. I, this was just, I'm letting you know what's going to happen. And you already said, yo, in this contract, one income is kind of an option. Well, you got to think of like, it like this. Crazy. As a father, your whole life, when you have a daughter, your yeah. whole life setup is to make sure my daughter is good. Right. Like, not to sound misogynistic, but once you pass her on, so to speak, you want to make sure that the person that's going to be, you know, with her can yeah. take care of her. I and yeah, see, I I softly understand that. It's just that my dad's so weird. That's not how he did with Manira. I mean, yeah. not my dad, and but but yeah, the thing is, but your sister. Yeah, yeah. She's independent, yeah. but at the same time, he's still gonna put it in her. Do not settle for less. You want somebody who's either on your level, right, 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 or somebody who can you know help see, and, assist. And, and, you. and for me, it's a little different because I you think know I'm having like, I'm having a daughter, so eventually yeah. I'm going to be having these conversations, right, right. When it t- comes time for her to, you know, date, uh, date when she's 35, and shit, you, you want to say she's 35? So, shut the fuck up! <laughs> shut the, you had two kids before you were 30, and you telling her to date at 35? I'm gonna just say one word. Shut the fuck up, <laughs> Amber Rose. Be a parent, if I wasn't hypocritical, man, oh, okay. Amber Rose. <laughs> All right, nigga. That's funny. Um, you can get right? you a Zoe Kravitz or an Amber Rose, bro. Yeah, bro. Either way, you ain't going to be happy. I'm, I'm <laughs> Zoe Kravitz. <laughs> ah. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Zoe Kravitz. I, I, can deal, I can deal with everything else. Yeah. She doing um, the same shit Amber Rose doing. Yeah, you just don't know about it. And just quieter. <laughs> the point I is, bro, just you mind your walk. bitch. You got to slow walk. <laughs> You gotta walk by your. You gotta walk by your. Zoe Kravitz right? was at the slump walk. Uh, you just ain't see her, <laughs> right? No, nah, but look, it's funny because you say that because like you know me and Danielle, we've I, I've lived in a one income household yeah. for like the last five years. Like okay. I'm, I'm the only one who's had a job. Yeah, and we've been able to survive, but I'm not like out spending money buying racks and shit, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, we gotta wrap this up. So I'm like, I go to the movies. Oh, okay. Um, what? but yeah. Oh, okay. It's like I wonder, like, cause her, you know, you seen her parents. Yeah, her dad got money. Yeah, right, Rolex just, money. Yeah, you know, I don't have <laughs> land near money. that shit, right? And yeah. I wonder, like, if he's had any conversations with her about like me as far as when it comes to my finances and shit. Yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah, I, knowing that me and Danielle are in the same position, predicament, pretty same much. predicament. Yeah, but like, don't you like, don't you too? Feel some sort of security knowing that you have a degree, like knowing that. Nigga. Like, <laughs> no, 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 no. Wait, wait, no, this is real. This is real no, life. No, because no, not like this no, is a no. You no, guys have something no, like no, concrete no. that you can. A, a bachelor no. degree is a new high school diploma. Mm. No, fuck any degree. I my homies out here with masters still trying to find jobs. They looking to me. Except my for homies, Jordan. Yeah, oh, Doctor Jordan. Oh, that. That nigga Sam. And my nigga Jeffrey When you can throw Your homies Yeezys Like here Take your 500s I don't even want them um, shit yeah, Take yeah. the 300 Take the fucking Fuck that When you can give Your homies jobs no, it, it, Oh no no On top of that it And it, Jordan Come on the show Jordan, Anyways Cone candles coming soon Cone candles coming soon yeah. But yeah bro Like it, Yeah and There's no sense of security But I always do wonder Like you know Cause I Cause uh, Key's dad is an engineer mm-hmm. So Understand it, It's a different 
here I am taking this art marketing. He's and, very he. He wants something that's very what's the word I'm looking not concrete, stru- structure concrete, understandable structure, and things like yeah. that. So it, it's something it, practical, right? Right. So like I said, like so like I said, going back to your tweet or going back to the afterpay, you broke as hell mm-hmm. from the entitlement of Instagram. From that, I really think that and the I promise is a good tie-in. I don't think Instagram gave us that entitlement. Mm-hmm. I think it's always been there. It has. From our previous generation, it's just I we think, can see I it think now. Now we yeah. just have analytics to prove it. We could just yeah. see it because better. we have with, more people saying. Because me it. witnessing that, what her dad was like, it essentially was saying, "Well, this is how many followers my daughter has. So, what can you make sure that you can supply this?" Yeah. That's essentially what he said. Yeah, so it's just it's, it's what it is, bro. But aren't, you guys are like kind of in the same. Yeah, yeah, no, that's you know it's different. It's crazy, so but if worse I mean, comes, we're not different. It's the same. That's it's, what I'm saying. We're in the same world. Yeah, but um, but yeah, it's it's just the. And just to, to end it, bro, the stamp that men get and that women get is crazy. Yeah. You know what I mean? The standards that we're supposed to uphold to versus, you know, the other uh, gender or whatever. It's just, it's fucking wild. Yeah. It's fucking yeah. wild. It's, um, this series over, man. Lakers lost. It's 63. Hey, I was going to ask you about it's that. 63 well, to 43. I got you a question. 63 but we're gonna, to 43 right now. We're going we to we we wrap it up. Oh we got some big God. shit. To, I got to go to the movies. I ain't going to front. I got to go to the movies. I what got, you about uh, to go see? Uh, Quiet Place Part Two. See, I'm trying to see that new Jason Statham movie. I was good. That's my nigga, bro. Jason good. Statham is really tight. What you yeah. gonna do with Wes? He come with us. Oh, he gonna go sleep in the movies. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, my name I've been Heems, your host, uh, your co-host here, Augusto Cone, and this big wolf here to tell you, mind your business, man. Just mind your fucking business. Ephraim, go ahead, talk to the people. Ephraim, you got. I try to fill it in when it's silent. <laughs> go. Yeah, you know it's your it's your favorite producer. Coming there to you live in the bathroom, perp. Y'all stay good out there. <laughs> uh, remember, stay happy. And stay optimistic. Yeah. Wolves leading wolves coming with all the merch. Your mama gonna love it. Your auntie Your gonna love it. Out with a magazine Shut and a up, shirt. bitch. It's my...